Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you my morning makeup routine. This is kind of something very lightweight, something easy. If you're a beginner, this is also something really good, really easy to do. It's nothing like super hard. It's actually really fast. Usually I can do it within like five minutes or less. Go ahead and get into this look. Okay, so first I'm going to use the Neutrogena Healthy Skin Enhancer. It's pretty much just like a, um, like a BB cream. It's not full coverage um, or anything like that. So I'm just going to put that all over my face. I'm going to take my Real Technique sponge and I'm going to blend it out. Um... The next thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and set that with the NYX Mineral Set It Don't Fret It Powder. You are going to think I'm done, like really dumb for saying this, but I just now figured to pour it into the lid to make it easier to get and less to use rather than dipping it straight into the pot. I mean, um, yeah, I didn't realize that until um, recently. At least I know it now, right? <laughs> Anything counts. Better late than never, right? That's what I say for my grades when I turn in late assignments. The next thing I do is my eyebrows. I use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow Pomade. I'm like absolutely in love with this stuff. I wanted to try it for so long and now I'm like absolutely in love with it. I'm in the shade Soft Brown. So like pushing it against the edge of the barrel also helps concentrate all that product onto the end of the your brush to kind of make that like super thin line but yeah does anybody else spend a lot of time on their eyebrows like trying to get them perfect see all those pictures out there with all those girls having like those a1 perfect eyebrows and I'm like bro like, I just want to cry. So, I don't know if I'm probably, I'm probably the only one who does this, but I like to use the spoolie after I do my brows because I feel like it helps me move the product around. Like, for example, if it's too concentrated up here, it helps me to soften it up. I'm probably the only one who can, like, do you guys see that? Like, it softens it up so much in the front. Like, can you see the difference? I don't know. I'm probably weird. Okay, so for the next thing I do, I usually do highlight, and I really love to use the Carly Bible palette. Um, if you don't know who Carly Bible is, she's a YouTuber, and she's fabulous at makeup here on YouTube. And she just came out with a deluxe version of her palette. I'm excited because she has some new highlighter shades and some new eyeshadow shades and she's by far like my favorite makeup youtuber other than mikey from glam and gore if you can relate boy yes yes anyways i like to use the rose gold highlighter here from her palette by this point I feel like I'm a little too glowy so then I will first of all take my powder brush and I will kind of blend this out just to get some of that pigment down to take my favorite blush by Tarte it's called the party got this one for my birthday and I'm going to apply that. I really, really love this shade. If you guys are really into nude blushes, this one is probably going to be a fave that you guys pick up. Mascara. And my favorite one by far is the Revlon Dramatic Definition Mascara. I really feel like this lengthens and really shows off my lashes so this is my fresh face that I use in the mornings for school this is what I would use on a daily basis it's nothing a lot it's just simple easy 10 minutes or less 
Generally, I do it in like five. Thank you guys for watching. If you found this video to be helpful, especially if you're a beginner, be sure you give it a thumbs up. If you haven't been able to view my video I did before this, it was my next Face Awards entry, you guys should definitely go check it out and leave me a comment and tell me what you thought about it or if you wanted to see some more looks like that. Um, I definitely had fun filming that video and if you guys want to see any other videos, be sure you let me know down in the comments below this video and I hope you guys have a wonderful day, wonderful week and I hope you had a wonderful Easter and bye guys.